tough loss. Uh, first thing I like to do is apologize to my team for putting them in a deeper hole than what we were already in, getting kicked out. I got to learn how to keep my composure. That's the first thing. Uh, the second thing is Jordy Fernandez did a hell of a job, as well as those players out on the floor did a hell of a job fighting down, fighting back from 11 or 12 or, or whatever they fought back from. It was a hell of a job for them to f give ourselves a chance. Uh, obviously, we missed free throws um, in the um, at the end of overtime. We missed three free throws that could have put the game away probably for us. And then, you know, we should have been up the floor trying to blitz Dame, making him take a tougher shot at the end of the game that he that the one that he hit to win it. So uh, we made some mistakes down the stretch that 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 could have changed the outcome of the game. Uh, but, you know, I, I, I tell you what, uh, I know David Guthrie and Brian Forte, great guys, great officials. I don't really know Inte uh, well, but he seems like a good guy. And they're human, and they all make mistakes. And I just want to – Dip, let me, let me see that, man. I just want to sh show you guys why I got kicked out of the game right here. This is in the first uh, – this is in the third, qu third quarter with 128 left to go in, in, in the third. And right here, you can, wa you can watch. Go back and watch. He uh, – Fox barely puts his hand on, uh, on Dame's hip, okay? Incidental contact. He didn't push him or anything. He barely puts his hand on there. And they give him three free throws. Now, at half, we were down, I think, 19 to 5 in the free throws. 19 to 5. And I know that happens sometimes. But that's very frustrating when at the end of the half, at the end of the half, from what I get, 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 get told all the time, Malik drives, uh, um, Lopez comes over and goes vertical with a forearm down here. Now, from what the NBA tells me the rule is, if you go vertical, you've got to have two hands up. Because Domus has his hand down here a lot, and they call him for it every time, and they always tell us, well, you got a forearm here. And they said that, that they said that Tonight, they said forearm could be here as long as it's not extended. So I don't know what the rules are in, in this situation. I need a clarification because, again, two hands up is what the rule is on verticality, but they were here and they said Lopez could do this. That's a five-point swing. They take away the two free throws, and then Milwaukee goes down and hits a three. And, and to end the half at 19-5, to five, that's tough to deal with, especially when you're getting told different interpretations on a rule. Okay, so now I go back. They call this foul. They call this foul again on Fox. Now again, that's he didn't push him. They they, they said it's, it's it's supposed to be incidental contact. They give him three free throws. Now watch this right right here. Fox comes off a pick and roll. The kid uh, uh, campaign. campaign hooks him, hooks his arm. Look at Fox's look at Fox's arm when he spins off of this. Hooks his arm, he almost falls. No incidental contact. He hooks his arm and almost falls, and and, and there's no foul. And 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 so th to me, as as a coach, I I I'm okay with look again. Boom. He almost falls, and that, that, that's that's at the fourth quarter at the 9:32 mark. I'm okay as a coach because because the referees are human, and they're gonna make mistakes. But you just hope. A, there's some sort of consistency. B, there's some sort of communication between the refs. And, and the refs tonight, they were great. They communicated with me all night. But in terms of the consistency, you guys saw it right here. Dame coming off the pick and roll and Foxy getting hooked and almost falling coming off the pick and roll. And then on top of that, if you get communication and you get some form of co uh, 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 consistency in the game, okay, then you can live with some things. You can live with it, but but the consistency that I see tonight wasn't wasn't my opinion there. And then I I I, I don't understand the rule. If if the rule is you got to go vertical and both hands up, how can you give? How can you take away two free throws when the guy got his forearm down here? Now, if the if if they're gonna change the rule on me and say okay, the forearm can be down here, another one can be up there. All right, then now I know it going forward. But that's not what the rule is because we get it called on Domus all the time, and they tell us he's got to have both hands up if you want to go vertical. That's why I got kicked out. For sure it was tonight, Slate. 
It was tonight. How, how, do you, how, how can 19 to 5 from the, from the free throw line? And like I said, I, hey, communicate. They did that. Have some sort of consistency. I, in my opinion, the consistency wasn't, wasn't here tonight. Not only that, on top of that, I'm getting told, a, to me, a simple basic rule of going vertical. I'm getting told two different things. And that is really inconsistent overall from the, from, from, from the officials. And again, they're human. They're good people. They're going to make mistakes. But we can't, be, we can't interpret a rule two different ways. We can't be told one thing and then we, we say, well, he, he, there wasn't a lot of contact. Because then you go back and you watch Fox, you watch Dame come off that, that pick and roll, there wasn't a lot of contact. The, the, the hand was on his hip, okay? There's not a, he didn't push him. He didn't extend it. The hand was on his hip early. And then you see Foxy come off and, and, and campaign hooks him and he almost falls down. I, I, I'm just, as you can tell, I'm, I'm beside myself. Now, again, we, we had a chance to win the game and, and, and we, we didn't get it done. But I, I, I'm telling you, man, to, to go through that, it, 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 it just, it, it's, it's, it's tough, man. It, it's tough to go through that. I apologize to them for putting them in a deeper hole. Uh, I also applauded them for fighting back and getting out of the hole. Uh, Jordy uh, Fernandez did a hell of a job. Um, the rest of the coaches did a hell of a job. And, you know, I told them we, we had our chances to win it, obviously. You know, they, they put themselves in a, in a position uh, uh, to, to win the ball game. You know, we made some mistakes. That, you know, we missed some free throws. D didn't pick up higher on Dame's uh, last second three-point make. And so it, it hurts. It hurts. It, it, you know, a lot of these losses hurt. But but I, I'm just, you know, you, you could take a loss because you're going to lose in this league. But, man, I'm, I, as you could tell, I'm just – I'm messed up right now because uh, of the different interpretations that I'm getting on this verticality rule. And then sometimes they say it's, it's incidental contact – and then sometimes they say it's not incidental. Like, like I, I, I don't know, man. I, I, I messed up right now. I don't know. Thank you. Yeah, I'm here.